every YouTube video, we've heard the ring doorbell like go off at this point. So we should just add that right here too. No, uh, but at the, there it goes again. Hello, hello, happy new year. We're in 2023, we've made it. We asked over on Instagram what videos you wanted to see on YouTube and the winner was my favorite products of 2022. So I'm gonna share several things that I've loved this year and honestly, probably more than just this year. And we're gonna link everything below in the description for you. So without further ado, let's share my favorite things from the past year. Books are a product, right? So we're gonna we're gonna do we're gonna do that. The Akatar series. Oh, I loved it so much. This is this is the last book of the series, but if you have not gotten on the Akatar train yet, just trust me, join me on it. It's a wonderful place to be. This series will sit with me forever. It was by far my favorite series to read. I'm gonna link all of them for you. Little tip, first book is a lot of world building. You gotta give it some time, all right? So not a lot of action until the end, but the second book and then through you know, the rest after that is where it's at. I think I'm gonna say that this might have, the last one might have been my favorite. I cried at the end of this book. That's how good it was. So just trust me. I shared my Adidas Ultra Boost sneakers. Those are by far one of my favorite products. So good for working out and running. I've owned them for years now. So it's not just a 2022 fave, but a fave for years. If you're looking for great sneakers to start off the year, they're the best. I feel they fit true to size. I'm a seven, they fit me great. I've got some room in the toe. I would say if you're in between sizes, maybe size up, but yeah, Adidas Ultra Boost is where it's at. On that note, you guys know my love for Athleta. Their Salutation Stash leggings are one of my favorites. Again, not just this past year, but for years specifically the Salutation Stash. Athleta is great. I much prefer it over some other brands that everyone knows and loves, but this particular style offers a lot of compression. The waistband isn't super thick. It's nice and thin. They stay in place during your workouts. And I literally wear a pair every single day. I've washed them a zillion times and they still look good as new. They don't pill. They're just the perfect pair of workout leggings. So highly recommend those. One of my favorite things from the past year was Kindle Unlimited. I remember when I first got Kindle and first started reading again, I said I wasn't really sure about Kindle Unlimited. I got like a lot of mixed reviews in my DMs. I read more books on Kindle Unlimited than I do not on Kindle Unlimited. So you pay a monthly fee and you have access to so many books. So many of my favorite authors have a variety of books on there like Megan Quinn, K.A. Tucker, Kate Stewart. So many, so many great books on there. I do recommend if you're someone who wants to kind of get back into reading and maybe you're struggling with actually sitting down and opening the book, I have my Kindle but I also have the Kindle app on my phone. I love having access on my phone because if I'm at a doctor's appointment waiting or something, I can just open it up. So highly recommend Kindle Unlimited, absolutely worth the fee every month. Okay, let's talk some beauty and skincare faves. Bare faced, you guys know, I probably talked about this till I was blue in the face, but honestly, my skincare regimen between revision skincare and bare faced with a mix of Elemis, because you guys know I love my Pro Collagen Marine Cream. These products have truly completely transformed my skin. I love them and I don't see myself changing my regimen anytime soon because it's been a night and day difference. I'm gonna put the before and after that I always show. This is like, I wanna say this was like, I feel like it was a six month difference in between the before and after insane how well these products work. So I cannot speak highly enough about Bare Faced and Revision and Elemis. They are fantastic products, my go-to for skincare. Also for skincare, another favorite product of 2022, and you guys have heard me share this one quite a bit, is the, I think it's Color Science, but their Total Eye 3 in 1. If you are someone like me who's got very dark circles or if you're under your eyes is more like inset, this stuff is a game changer. It's tinted, it's an eye cream that's tinted and has SPF. So I can get away with wearing like a tinted SPF and then putting the color signs under my eyes and it really helps brighten the darkness quite a bit. I have gotten to a point where I feel more comfortable going out without makeup. I know a lot of you have also purchased it who have the same issue as me, very dark under eye circles and you love it as well. A little goes a very long way. I don't even use an entire 
entire pump on my finger. I just dab it under my eyes. It's my last, very last step of my skincare routine in the morning. I apply it after I put on my tinted SPF and it's just life changing. So if you're like me, highly recommend it. I started using Babelash. I feel like I actually started using it back in 2021 and it is insane to me how well this stuff works. But this stuff, I swear by, I apply it every evening before bed. It makes your lashes like so good. And you can also apply the conditioner in the morning, but honestly, just the serum at night is enough. So this past year, I started going on air for QVC and therefore I wanted to kind of learn a little, like more how to glam up my face a little bit before going on air little heavier of makeup than what I normally do. And I'll be totally honest, I'm not really good at applying makeup. This palette is beautiful. I actually have it on now. I absolutely love it. It's been re a really great way to just amp up my eyes before going on air. And now I use it if I'm going somewhere like a date night or out with friends because the colors are super neutral. They're warm neutrals and they're beautiful. They blend so nicely. Absolutely love it. It's definitely a pricier palette, but it's the one palette that I like consistently have used this past year. So I'll be very sad. Like I'm running low on one of the shades and I'm gonna have to immediately buy another one because I'm not gonna be able to be without it. So Patrick Ta, fabulous palette. Our favorite. This is actually a shade I got, I think in a, I have this here in my office, Salt Life. I love this stuff so much. I always say it's like, a lip gloss and a lip balm got married and had a baby. Like that's the best way I could describe this stuff. It is like super, what's the word? I don't want to describe it. It's super hydrating. It just adds like a little tint. It's almost like you're just applying like a tinted chapstick, but better than that. I don't know. I love it. I have every shade. I know a lot of you love it too. By far my favorite. I have one in my car, my purse. My makeup bag, my office, they're all over. I love them. I can't even, they're so good. They're so good. I have multiple pairs in the same wash because I'm just so afraid something's gonna happen to them and then they're not gonna make them anymore. You ever do that? I'm just like, I just need multiples because then I just always have them. I love them. They fit so well. I have a shorter torso and longer legs. So high-waisted things on me sometimes can be a little weird. These are considered high-rise. They fit right at my belly button. They're comfortable. They're soft. They don't have a lot of stretch, but they're not super stiff either. So there's like a little stretch to them. The only thing is I've tried to order these in other washes and they just don't fit the same. I'm not really sure why, but this pair in particular is chef's kiss. Perfect. You knew this was going to make the list. I still love this thing, guys. I think I first shared it a couple years ago. And at this point, almost every toilet in my house has a bidet. I've installed Toshiba Days at our villa in St. John. I have a travel one. I'm not going anywhere without my bidet. It's super easy to install it. You can put it on any toilet and it's just great. I mean, clean butts for everyone. I don't know. I love Equilibria. I've been using it for over a year. High quality CBD. It has been very, very helpful with my anxiety. I love their gummies. I love their rapid calming mouths. I had to go on air at like 2 a.m. the other day and then falling back to sleep, I, know, I knew it was gonna be an issue. They have these like rapid sleep melts and they really do work. Help me go back to sleep very quickly. I just love Equilibria as a whole. If you're looking to try their CBD, I do have a code in the comments. Again, it's something I've been using for I think over two years at this point. Highly recommend. Now, I know there's a lot of controversy over the best insulated cup, but the one everyone loves is not the one I love. I actually think that one's garbage. The one that's where it's at is the Brewmate rehydration bottle. I love this thing. 25 ounces. I honestly just wish they made it bigger. I, I actually messaged them. I sent them a DM and said, I just need you to make like a 40 ounce one with a handle and we'll be set. But love this thing. It literally keeps ice cold for over 24 hours. It's crazy. I've had it on the beach in the hot sun. It's triple insulated stainless steel. It keeps drinks 
ice cold. But I also just love Brumay in general, everything that they have. So they have their, um, the toddy, which is what I drink my coffee in. It actually keeps your coffee hot and it has like a uh, leak proof top. So you don't have to worry about spilling coffee all over your car, you know? Or maybe it's just me who's done that. Anyway, their Hopsolator Slim. I don't know. I love everything from them. So this is this brand is where it's at. Not that other brand everyone talks about. This thing is fantastic. Target usually has it on sale. I love it as a step bench. I use it, you know, to lift weights. The seat inclines, so you could use it as an incline bench. A variety of ways to use it. So if you're looking to add to your home gym, if that's something that you have at your house, highly recommend this. It is absolutely worth the investment. This is actually Caviar Bar. We gave this color away over on Instagram last year. I love it. It's like a really dark blue. I've been having fun. I usually wear my pre-show jitters. You guys know this is my favorite, like pinky white shade. But I've been trying to go outside the box a little bit. So this is Caviar Bar. I also liked, I love All Checked Out. It's a really pretty brown. Electric Geometric was my go-to red for the holiday season. So many others. But what I love about the polish is it gives a gel-like finish, but it comes off with nail polish remover. And I have oily nail beds. I don't know why. And regular polish does not stay on my nails. So I can get like a week out of this polish on my nails. I've got several tutorials over on my Instagram on how I paint my nails. It's, it's Essie for life for me. When we were in St. John, there's a lot of no is what they're called and, and mosquitoes down there. That's just island life. And my kids get eaten alive, no matter how much bug spray I spray on them. I went into this little shop, said, I need something. My son is like dying from being so itchy. And the woman at the desk was like, this stuff is really great. I'm like, whatever, uh, I'll take anything at this point. So I was a little skeptical because I'd never heard of it before. This stuff immediately takes the itch away. I don't know how. It is incredible. I left it down in our house down in St. John. I also bought some for here. I also got a few other products of theirs to try. They have a lot of like natural soaps, but it's all natural and it works insanely well, like way better than any other no itch cream. It also is a bug repellent too. So now if you just take like a little dab, rub it on that bug bite, I'm not even kidding within 10 seconds, the itch is gone. So if you have someone in your family who gets eaten alive by mosquitoes or other bugs like that, this stuff is incredible. I still take this every day. I think it's been over a year of me religiously taking this in the morning. I love that it's greens. It's also a multivitamin. It has probiotics in it. Um, I have a link in the comment below that actually gets you a free year supply of their vitamin D drops that I put those in my drink every morning as well. But I love it because it's kind of like an all in one product for me. I get a lot of people asking what it tastes like. I don't really think it tastes like anything, I do need it to be ice cold and I and I shake it so that it's not super gritty. I have heard people say they'll add some apple juice or some lemon or they'll even use it in a smoothie if you have a hard time with the taste, but it has helped my GI system significantly. Highly recommend. Okay, so this next one is not really uh, my favorite product. It's a Pat's favorite product. <laughs> And that's his infrared sauna. But believe it or not, I'm asked about this sauna all the time on Instagram. It's so funny because he bought this thing. I don't even know. I want to say like over three years ago at this point, it was, he first had it in our old house and we've been in this house for almost three years. So like over three years, he uses it every night. <laughs> and so many of you use it too. So Honestly, I don't really know much about infrared saunas, but he swears by it and it's got good reviews. Their bags are still my favorite. Their beach bags actually updated their beach bag this year and it's even bigger and even better. It is fantastic. I use their backpacks. I use their fanny packs. I use their wallets. The reason they're so great is because they're waterproof and they're also washable. So I love using their backpack when I travel because I don't know about you guys, but after traveling, I need to like immediately come home and shower after being on the plane. And what I love is I can take the bag, just throw it in the washing machine and it comes out good as new. So I've gotten a lot of my family members hooked on these bags at this point. We swear by them. The beach bags are awesome. Again, waterproof, 
we were at the beach uh, down in St. John recently and the, the tide was really high. And my mom was like, the bags, because it was coming up and getting all the bags wet. And I'm like, nope, remember, they're waterproof. Totally fine. So definitely an investment, but I've got a code in the description below for you guys if you want to give it a try. So I'm a big rum fan. Rum punch is like my go-to island drink. This is actually Kenny Chesney's rum line. And I was introduced to all of the flavors this year. But if you love rum as well, I highly recommend checking it out. It is by far my favorite. We, we've gone through quite a bit here when we've got some family get togethers in my house. It is delicious. My podcast. I have to tell you guys, this was something that I had been dreaming about doing for years. I actually wanted to do a podcast on motherhood. I'm so glad I didn't. <laughs> Not that I don't love motherhood, but this way more fun to talk about. I genuinely love talking about books. That is something I did for myself the past two years. I got back into reading and I cannot even express how what that's done for me. It brings me such joy. It helps me kind of escape. It helps my anxiety. It just helps me have some time to myself in someone else's world just for a little bit. You know, when I need it, it helps me calm down at night. And so this product, this creation of that love has been so fulfilling and just so fun to do. I love chatting with my co-host, very much unscripted, and it's just been something I've genuinely enjoyed doing. And on that note, the last thing I'm gonna leave you with, something that I really focused on this year, is not necessarily something you can buy, but something you can do, and that has been my favorite thing of this past year. Making sure that you're taking time for yourself, self-care, prioritizing the people and the things that are important to you in life. Making that a goal for me in 2022 really was eye-opening and my mental health, my physical health, and just my life health in general with my family, my friends, my husband, my parents and all of that has honestly been the best it's ever been. And I only hope I can continue doing that in 2023. So I leave you with that. All the stuff that I've shared is super fun, but I encourage you to invest time in yourself because you will be the best product in 2023 if you do so. All right, see you guys next time.